I've never heard those kind of songs before, although although I, I, I close up, you know, I, I'd heard them on records, but I, I hadn't heard them close up. Uh, all the the legendary people they used to sing about, uh, the, the, the Brennan on the Moor or Roddy McCorley or these people, they, they I wasn't aware of them when they existed, but but it was as if they just existed yesterday. When you were around them all the time, and they just sang so many songs all, all the time. You just uh, you couldn't help but the first album I made, I, I, there was one song on it that it was an old song from I'd heard on an old banjo record someplace. But I, I did that song the way the Clancy Brothers I thought would have done it, you know, if uh, you know in their style. For me, I never heard a singer as good as Liam ever. He was just the best ballad singer I'd ever heard in my life. Uh, and still is, probably. I, I don't think I, I can think of anybody who's a better ballad singer than Liam. White Horse Tavern was, it was the place where Dylan Thomas took his last drink. Some say his last 36 drinks. And I thought it only fair when I met Bob Dylan first. He came in as a young fellow of 20. I was in my 20s. We used to hang around together. And uh, there was a couple of great things, good things going about the White Horse. I had a tab there for one thing, and we had no money. I also wanted him to come and see the place where his namesake had died. But also we had uh, fantastic sessions in the back room. The White Horse was run by, was owned by an old German named Ernie, known as Ernie the German, <laughs> strangely enough. <laughs> he always at the close of the night, Ernie would say, you don't have to go home yet can't stay here and uh, we used to close with the parting glass and the parting glass was uh, it became a, a ritual to do the parting glass I'll sing you one verse of it just to give you an idea oh all the money mm, I spent I spent it in good company and all the harm that e'er I've done. Alas, it was to none but me and all I've done for want of a wit to memory now I can't So fill to me the parting glass. Good night and joy be with you all. Well, this song stuck in Bob Dylan's mind at a tough point in his life where he was saying farewell to old friends and who had accused him of taking money wrongfully and things like that. He was moving on and he rushed into the studio and recorded a song called The Restless Farewell. And at the end of the first verse he described so graphically the back room of the White Horse at closing time. Oh the money that in my whole life I spent, be it mine right or wrongfully, I let it slip gladly past the hands of my friends to tie up the time most forcefully. But the bottles are done. We've killed each one And the table's full And overflow And 
the corner sign says it's closing time. So I'll bid farewell and be down. And every girl that ever I touched Oh, I didn't do it harmfully And every girl that ever I hurt I didn't do it knowingly But to make amends and remain as friends You need the time to stay behind And since my feet are now fast And point away from the past I'll bid farewell and be down Every foe that ever I fought The cause was there before we came And every cause that ever I fought I fought it full without regret or shame But the time is not all if on time you depend And no word is possessed By no special friend And though the line is cut It's still not the end I'll just bid farewell Till we meet